So I uh, changed up a few things on my ADC. Thought I'd go ahead and give you all an update on that. I uh, kind of figured out this is the the way I like things, and kind of stuck with this. I um I do have two sets, if that makes sense, because working at a hospital four days a week, obviously I I, I can't carry a firearm. I can barely get away with carrying a pocket knife there, but um, I'll uh. I'll, I'll wear kind of like half of my hospital uniform because I wear a scrub top, obviously, but uh, I wear 511 EMS tack lap pants, which are right here. I wear these on the weekday. Love these pants. They're amazing. I would recommend them to anybody who wanted some good EMS pants or even tactical pants. I mean, they got 17 pockets. I mean, you can do anything with them. Built like a tank. Love them to death, but whenever I'm working at work or uh, during the weekday, I wear those pants. I'll have a, a pair of EDC gear branded trauma shears with me, just bright orange. Um, I bought these when I was still working on the fire department, so bright orange was a really nice color because I'd work late at night on the side of the road, and if I sat them down, they'd be easy to see. Carry a pair of rubber hospital gloves. And white notepad other than that that's the only thing I add to my EDC as a, opposed to when I'm not working on the weekends I'm always wearing my, my Wrangler flex jeans and I've always got my my Condor ball cap with me you've seen before I'm pretty much set with this morale patch the uh, the black American flag I mean I, I love it to death it's pretty much staying I did change my firearm quite up a bit. Uh, I bought another firearm. I've been carrying a uh, PF940C with a Olight Balder Pro R. And I don't know how well y'all can see that, but it's got a green laser, light and laser, and then just light thing is stupid bright it's got two brightness settings low and high and strobe love it to death i uh, was kind of skeptical with olight i know they're made in china and they're not cheap this is about 120 dollar light but i love the the quick connect system that they put on there it's it's phenomenal as for sights I've just got a standard red fiber optic using Magpul magazines and uh, Freedom Munitions 124 grain X def or no 147 grain that's my, my favorite grain weight for 9 millimeter as for holsters I'm just using a uh, generic eBay Kydex holster it's unbranded there's really not much to say there it's just Two slabs of pan or pancaked uh, Kydex riveted together. The belt loops that came with it were way too small for my mystery leather gun belt that was given to me. There's no stampings on it, so I don't know what brand it is. Uh, I can't tell you there, but for belt loops now, I don't know how well you can see that, but uh, I just got an old shoelace loop it around twice and put a prusik knot on there holds it like a champ I can draw reholster real easily I mean it stays nice and secure um, staying with the firearm I carry a Magpul 21 round magazine as a backup in my front left pocket again 147 X def being in Montana, if I'm going out hiking out in the woods, my river, something like that, I will carry, um, instead of this magazine in my pocket, I'll carry this one and I'll swap out the mag. This one's got 147 grain full metal jacket flat points. As opposed to a popular opinion, these are actually decent barrel loads if you mag dump into them. I don't have anything 
really great for bears. I'm still working on 10 millimeter. That's good enough for now. I still think that's real sketchy and want to, wouldn't want to do it. I prefer bear spray myself, but as a backup, I'll have it. Um, I always got my leather wallet. Not much to say there, really. Got my my keys. And on my key ring, I've got my F-150 key fob. Whenever I bought that Olight weapon light recently, it came with a free keychain light. It's a uh, 1R2 Pro. I1R2 Pro, excuse me. But this thing is amazing. I wasn't expecting it. They sent it to me for free, but if you untwist it all the way, it's got a Samsung charger port for your cell phone. It's got low and stupid high. This thing is brighter than my stream light I carry in my pocket. I mean, it's phenomenal. I don't know the actual lumens on it. Um, if I had to guess, the first one's probably about 15, maybe 20 lumens. And then the high setting, maybe about 90, 100. I mean, it's, it's stupid bright for what it is. Other than that, I've got gun safe key, locker key, house key, some dollar store nail clippers, and that's about it for the key ring. On uh, my other back pocket, that's where I carry my cell phone. I'm filming with it right now. I can't really show you that. It's a uh, AT&T Maestro Plus, if anybody cares. Going from there in my left pocket again I carry Apple earbuds that's that's about the only thing Apple ever made that I like a sharpie because you can do anything with a sharpie my Streamlight Stylus Pro the uh, dual AAA model it's really nice and bright the button is stupid stiff on it though, so you're not turning that on by accident. And then my big pen with a cap because I prefer caps on them. And this is a amazing pen, writes beautifully. As for that, that's about it. Um, my boots recently got some new boots. I freaking love these things. These are the uh, Under Armour Valsets RTS 1.5s. These are really, really light, very, very comfortable. I wear them at the hospital all the time. The tread is phenomenal for anything off road, on road, whatever. If you're running down a sidewalk, you got plenty of traction. If you decide to go down a gravel road or just running through the woods, whatever, you'll have plenty of traction with these. They're great and slick surfaces. I will say the laces on them suck. I put some uh, military boot laces on them those seem to work really good but the insoles and the outsole and everything's holding up great i've got according to my pedometer about 100 miles on these and shreds holding up on them great uh quit wearing a watch my band broke i'm too lazy to sew it back up other than that um and my my cross necklace that i forgot I even had I found it in a bunch of crap of mine again it was given to me I don't know anything about it but uh, that's about it y'all uh, well, as, as per usual y'all take care be safe have a good one and don't do anything stupid without me